Harika, you won the bronze medal, the first ever medal for Indian women's team in the history of Indian chess. How do you feel? What can I say? My debut was in 2004 as a kid, 13 year old. Uh, I dreamt about going on, going on the podium. And since then, I have been waiting every single time in the Olympia to go on the podium. And it's so special that we managed to do it in India. And uh, though we could have won better medal, but still I'm glad that we made the first move to get some medal for India, Indian women's team. And uh, it feels really, really emotional uh, because uh, you start as a kid in the team and you dreamt about it, especially right now. Uh, I attempted to play in this pregnancy, uh, especially because I didn't want to leave my dream coming through and I wanted to help the team to win the medal. And uh, I was so rigid not to go back without medal. And uh, I'm, I'm managing to do that, so I'm happy with that. But uh, yeah, it could have been better, but there is always a start. So this is the start for Indian women's chess. And uh, I hope uh, things get even, even bigger and better from next time. Is it true that the due date is just one week away? Uh, actually, my due date is not one week away, but uh, it was August 10. Uh, but now, I don't know, like, uh, when I consulted the doctor, they said like, two days back that I, I'm ready for delivery any time, so oh. better to go back. So I'm glad that I'm going back. I was hoping that uh, nothing of this sort happens during the tournament, and so I'm so happy that uh, I'm managing to go back without any problems. When you got under time pressure or under tense position, were you feeling any different from normal times? No, definitely it has been different. I, uh, I worked really a lot uh, once I got to know that Olympiad and I can participate when my doctor told that I can, uh, physically possible. Uh, and I worked really hard because I know that there will be a lot of physical limitations. That's why I think my game quality was fine overall. I'm happy with the game quality. But uh, I think to convert the position, we need a lot of patience which has been uh, very tiring and exhausting because I'm into the last trimester. I could feel the difference of uh, physical, uh, physically not being so fit and uh, in completely different level. But I tried to do my best for the team and I think I managed as much as I could. Uh, though physical limitations were You played were seven rounds in a row. Yeah, frankly speaking, I thought I would play like a couple of uh, four to five crucial games. And that's what I came prepared for. <laughs> And when I played seven games in a row, even I got surprised and I actually enjoyed playing also. It's not like I didn't enjoy. I enjoyed playing. It's a different way of uh, uh, feeling to play in this uh, time. It's like the, so many people are supporting you. The arbiters, the management, the organizers. And there were like special arrangements done for me. So I'm very thankful for them who did all that so that uh, I could be possibly playing here. And because of that, it encouraged me also that I'm not here just to sit there. I just wanted to contribute to the team. So definitely, this is one of the most uh, emotional decisions I've taken. And I'm glad that I'm going with the medal. Uh, especially when this came on my tummy, I felt that, okay, this is my baby's first medal. Wow! So it, it felt a little emotional that, okay, finally we managed to do it. We are all very emotional, we are all very proud of you and I think your your husband and your grandma both were here to take care of you. So I think you were comfortable in that sense. Yeah, definitely. My family, they never doubted my decision. They never asked like second time, is it okay or not. When I said I will play, they were okay with it. They are all ready to help me out. And uh, I can say for the past 3-4 months, I was physically trying to be fit and be ready to play. So it was a completely roller coaster ride. Like I've been living for this moment for the past 3-4 months. Uh, because in normal times, it's very normal. But when you are going through different changes, you would want to do both as an athlete and also your duty as a mother. So it's been a little different journey. It was uh, really like a kind of, I was very, very adamant to come here, to play here and to win the medal. And uh, I think without my family support, I wouldn't have done it. Like my parents' house is just five minutes away. I didn't even go there much, like uh, just to be ready for the tournament, to prepare for the tournament. So now I'll go back and enjoy my life. <laughs> and thanks to my grandmother, Karthik, who are like, I think without them it wouldn't have been possible uh, for 15, like the, all these days they were here with me and supporting me in, uh, in every which way. And my family back home, they were supporting all the way. And of course the team members who understand my situation and who were ready to play all the games. 
and Abhijit Dada. Uh, we like uh, over everything. Swayam, Sham, and for especially Sham knows that she is so emotional. He used to be worried about me and uh, how I'm bending and playing during the game. So Sham has been a very good support emotionally and also to, uh, for the chess. And uh, it's been one wonderful journey. Definitely, it could have been better, but uh, I don't have any regrets. I think uh, always there is someday written for you. So when I started my Olympiad at 13, it was not written. And uh, now when I'm into my <laughs> uh, 30 and like you know having a baby, it is written that I should win now. So it's like always. But I was uh, just one thing worked for me is I was very rigid and uh, adamant on my dreams and. Uh, out well. Your dedication is exemplary. Even now, you can see this interview you are giving with your hundred percent. That's what makes you special, Harika. We are amazed. You are an inspiration. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you so much. Kartik, uh, how does it feel that Harika won the bronze medal uh, and the Indian team? Actually, I'm so proud that Harika is playing in this situation. She's a nine month pregnant. She'll be thrilled and waiting for the baby to come. When is the due date? Uh, maybe in one week. One week? Wow. So no how one knows that. No one knows that. No one either. knows that. Yes, and yes. How, how much stressed you were when she I'm was... I'm not stressed. I'm cool. But it, uh, I'm much uh, tend to get the baby out. <laughs> and, because and she's playing all stressful games and now she's in relaxed mode. Hope uh, uh, we are waiting for the baby and we'll get a good this thing. And her uh, hard work gave her medal. I'm so proud of her. Amazing.